everybody and welcome to another Big C TV unboxing. My name is Chris aka Big C and I have the November Candy Club subscription. Now before we get started, I want to let everybody know I've only got one, maybe two more of these left. That is because, unfortunately, because of my financial situation right now, I'm going to have to cancel my Candy Club membership in uh, January, which is when the 12 months that I got last year ends. Um, it's kind of a shame because I've really enjoyed doing these. I really enjoyed trying all these different kinds of candy. Um, I might bring them back if I can get enough Patreon support to help with that. Um, but it's, you know, 25, 26 bucks a month, and if I do the year plan, and there are some months where I struggle to get that. So, um, as much as I've enjoyed doing these unboxings, I might not be able to do them too much longer. So, I will at least have one for December. I don't know if January's is included. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, so I might only have one more Candy Club unboxing left after this one. So... Let's enjoy November's Candy Club membership. Let's see what we got. Okay. So, as per usual, I'm going to read the descriptions of the candies included, and then we will show you what they look like and try them all. So, we have I am actually very excited about all of these. So we start off with the um, the splash this month. We're back to um, saltwater taffy, which is always a favorite of mine. We have sweets chocolate hazelnut saltwater taffy. Um, sweets saltwater taffy is whipped, not pulled, allowing for a flavorable, less sticky, softer piece of taffy. Sweets Chocolate Hazelnut Toffee has a rich chocolate taste with a creamy hazelnut flavor. That sounds delicious. I'm excited to try that. Next, we have Lucky Country Berry Blend Licorice. Get a wonderful and fragrant burst berry flavor when you pop this licorice in your mouth. This soft and smooth licorice delivers more flavor in every bite compared to the standard hard licorice. Enjoy. I will. Next, we have Sour Patch Fruit Salad. These irresistible, soft, and chewy candies, shaped like and colored like real fruit, offer a sour burst of tart fruit flavors in every bite, deliciously chewy and mouth puckering. This candy is a power popular sour selection, I would imagine. Lastly, we have Vital Sour Strawberries. Fresh strawberry taste dusted with a mouth puckering sour sugar. These sour strawberry gummies are sure to become a household favorite. That's what we got. So let's take a look at these. See what everything looks like. Grabbing the splash. So these are the chocolate hazelnut taffies. Those all look quite delicious. I'm really excited to try the chocolate hazelnut. Here are the sour strawberries. There's the berry licorice. And sour patch fruit salad. All right, start off with, let's do a mix. So I got two sour candies this month. So I'm gonna do the strawberries, the licorice, and then the fruit salad, and then the chocolate hazelnut. Uh, so we're happy, so. Interesting. This is what the sour strawberry looks like up close. Let's give it a try. Bottoms up. Pretty good. Um, not super sour. But typically, sour strawberry isn't super sour. Like, it can be kind of tart. These are tart. Um, 
good flavor though. Like they have a nice strawberry flavor to them. Let me try one more. Pretty solid. So I enjoy those. Next we're gonna do the berry licorice. <clears throat> so let's give these a shot. Here's what they look like. They're very soft. Let's try it out. Bottoms up. Very good. Um, they have kind of a deep licorice, or not licorice, but they have a deep berry flavor. Um, they're very soft, very smooth. Um, yeah, these are these are top notch. They're they're quite delicious. Let me eat one more. Give an accurate flavor test. good next sour patch fruit salad smells good I'm gonna try orange first I'll try different flavors just to make sure they're good um, so I'll start with an orange Disappointing. The sour isn't really that sour. I was expecting like Sour Patch Kids level sour. This didn't have it. The orange flavor was lacking too, which is kind of disappointing. I'm going to try a cherry next. Let's try that one. Same story. Um, that one was a little tartar, but the flavor is kind of flat. That's really disappointing because, like, this looks like a good variety. I'll try one more. I'll try the grape. Like that one, I got a little bit of the grape problem with this type of gummy is the the coating is going to add a lot of flavor to it but you need the the fruit flavor to really punch in the face this one was kind of a whimper like it's there but it's not particularly strong and i think that's the biggest disappointment about it is just the flavor is kind of weak um so two out of the three main ones are, are good. The third one's kind of eh. Now let's try one of these chocolate hazelnut toffee. Sweet saltwater taffy. Let's see how they are. Smells good. Bottoms up.
Sorry, it's a little chewy. Okay. The chocolate is spot on. You taste the hazelnut. Typically, things that are not chocolate, that are chocolate flavored, kind of fall on their face. That did not. It has really good chocolate flavor. Um, the hazelnut's kind of mellow. It's not super assertive, but typically hazelnut's not a super assertive flavor anyway. You can definitely taste it. The thing that I'm a little disappointed about is on the description, it talks about it being really soft. It wasn't. It was a little harder. Like, it was typical taffy hardness. Um, kind of chewy. But I didn't mind chewing it because the flavor was really good. So, I think it's got... Um, I think very solid. Very, very good flavored uh, saltwater taffy. So, that's all... Four of our Candy Club offerings for the month of November, and that is going to do it for this Big CTV unboxing. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit that subscribe button on YouTube. Uh, be sure to subscribe on Twitch at Big CTV. Um, check us out on social media at Big CTV Show on both Facebook and Twitter. And if you want to see me continue to do Candy Club unboxings or Help me to create higher quality and more frequent videos. Um, become a Patreon patron at patreon.com slash bigctv where you can get some cool exclusive stuff um, as well as you're helping to contribute to the future of Big CTV. So pretty cool stuff. Anyway, thanks for watching and I will see you next time on Big CTV Unboxing.